and kicked me in the balls. What balls? <laughs> um, she wasn't that smart. She just started hitting me. So I took out my shotgun. She didn't even run. She didn't even run, folks. I, just, I shot her and she died. Dude, you don't shoot an old lady because she decided to fight back against you. I mean, you were beating her up. I mean, of course she was going to fight back against you, so really, she was that smart. The game is that realistic. I was like, whoa, I, what, the, what, what is that? It's, it's not, it's not realistic. Especially, especially the death. Everyone, see, when people die in the game, it, it doesn't even make sense. You, you shoot them, and... It, it doesn't matter where you shoot them, they just die. Like, you could shoot someone in the foot, and they'd explode into a million- I tried this. I shot someone with a pistol in the knee, and they exploded. You're complaining about an explosion in an epic video game? WTF, mate. Folks, I'm not kidding. Guts everywhere, they exploded, and I- I do not understand. I don't understand. How is that supposed to be fun? Here's another problem with GTA 3. Is, um... You know, feel free to say something for me to pwn you on any time you feel like it. Honestly? 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 You can't go in to buildings. I couldn't believe it either. You can't go into buildings. And I spent, I spent like 30 fucking minutes trying to get into this one, um, big ass building. You spent 30 minutes trying to get into one building? Okay, that doesn't make sense. That's something that you need to complain about not making sense. And, uh, Believe me, I tried. I, I looked up how to get in them, I looked at fucking game facts. Nothing, and I, I figured out, I tried every building in the city, I, systematically, it took me a long ass time, but I tried every building in the city, you can't go into any of them folks. Except for the ones that lead directly to outdoor environments, there are no real indoor environments folks. Another problem with, uh, with GTA, it's not first person. Not for this person shooter. I don't know what's 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 up with that. Wait, wait, wait. You mean to tell me that one of the reasons you don't like GTA is because it's not a first person shooter game? That is just stupid. That really makes you sound like you don't know what you're talking about. Not all games are supposed to be first person shooter games, alright? Get that through your skull. Not a first person shooter, folks. So, uh. You know, I bought GTA 3, think it was a first person shooter, I was looked down. And, uh. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. And, uh. If it were a first person shooter, it would be amazing. It would. I, I don't even care if they improve the graphics, just first person instantly amazing. What? You mean to tell me a first person shooter is the only thing that can make a game like GTA good in your eyes? Oh. My. God. You've been playing too much Call of Duty. That's a fact. Automatically. Amazing. And, um... Here's something else I couldn't believe. They made a- they made a fourth GTA. Uh, to my knowledge, GTA- here's another strange thing about the numbering. To my knowledge, GTA 1 and 2 don't exist. They're wow! Very invalid just came as close as he has this whole video to saying something that actually seemed profound. This is one of those moments where you can say, wait for it? These games called uh, Grand Theft Auto 1 and Grand Theft Auto 2, but um, they are not in 3D. And it appears that they are a cheap, they are cheap bootlegs. I totally called that one. Of GTA 3. And, um, it's very strange. They're, they're very... Jesus, tab dancing Christ. 
do you think you would have at least rehearsed this just a little, you know? At least try to keep him stammering about as much as Chris Chan. They... They are actually better, folks. They are better than GTA. Uh, GTA 2. That's right. These Campbell um, top-down bootlegs are better than GTA 3. They control better. They sound better. They play better. Oh, yeah, the video's almost over, and now you talk about the gameplay. Now you talk about the soundtrack. Now you talk about the controls. Where was that for the last, like, five six minutes. They even look better, because, like, you're, you're so high up, you can't even fucking tell what's going on. It, it even looks better. No, I'd, I'd like to end it at that, folks. Please do end it at that, because I think I speak for a lot of people watching this video right now when I say, just end the video right here and now before you make yourself look like an even bigger idiot. GTA 3 sucks. So does GTA 4. What are you talking about? The only real problem I had with GTA 4 was the fact that Nico Bellic, the voice actor, was just so crappy. I actually played that at a friend's house. I was, it was the same as GTA 3, except the graphics looked so realistic you didn't want to kill anyone. What happened to, I'm just gonna end it at that, what happened to that? It's like, oh, look at that old lady crossing, oh my god, I can't kill her, she's too realistic. So yeah. That's all I have to say. Is that really all you have to say? Because earlier you said I'm just gonna edit that and the video goes on for like another 30 seconds. <laughs>